Jalen earned her Juris Doctor from Washburn in 1987, and she has been Associate Dean for Student Affairs at Washburn Law since 2011. In her role, she advises students, supervises student organizations, and plans student orientation and professionalism training. Her work in law includes clerking for Justice Harold Hurd and Chief Justice Robert Miller of the Kansas Supreme Court. Judge Nancy Lawrence, a Washburn graduate and judge of the United States Court of Appeals for the Tenth Circuit, said this of her friend. Jalen is one of the humblest people I know, so it's going to kill her to sit here and listen to these laudatory remarks. I am ordering her to listen and not attempt to deflect these compliments to others, as she so often does. Judge Morris went on to say, Jalen's rare combination of skills makes her particularly suited for diffusing stressful situations, and we all know law school can generate a few stressful situations every now and then. Sarah Pride, a current student, continued with these compliments, saying, your positive attitude lights up every room, and you somehow make every student feel exceptional and important. Recent graduate Casey Van Dong said, I have never felt like I didn't have someone to talk to or bounce ideas off. I will consider you a mentor and friend for life. Assistant Dean for Admissions Preston Nicholson said, you have made an impact for greater than, far greater than you can probably imagine, and you have been a calming influence for students in this very stressful time in their lives. Dean Carla Pratt said, you are an exemplary model of integrity, intelligence, diligence, and humility, all the attributes that we want our leaders and lawyers to have. Jalen, on behalf of the Washburn Alumni Association and School of Law, we are pleased to honor you as a Washburn Alumni Fellow. The first thing I would like to do is, I'm sorry, I already planned this out, Judge Ward. I would like to introduce one of our most famous alums, the Honorable Nancy Moritz of the U.S. Court of Appeals. Uh, Judge Moritz received both her undergrad and her law degree at Washburn. And she and I have a favor to ask of you. If I mention your name, and if you can comfortably do so, will you stand and remain standing for the entire three minutes that I'm up here? <laughs> Judge Moritz is videotaping this, and I want to make sure that she gets a great video. I'm asking people to stand partly so that you might see someone you know across the room, but primarily for the benefit of my mama who very much wanted to be here, but couldn't because she is recovering from surgery. My mother, like many young women of the 50s, married shortly after high school. She had five children before the age, by the age of 23. We won't have time for the rest of her story, but suffice it to say that she is now Dr. Ellen Paulson beloved by her family, a woman who has helped and continues to help thousands of people, and who is currently having a video of this event made by a federal court of appeals judge. <laughs> Mama, I want to introduce you first to people at my table. Uh, our new law school dean, Carla Pratt, who you've heard so many good things about. Shelly Sutton, executive director of Kansas Continuing Legal Education and adjunct professor at Washburn for over two decades. Assistant director, Cindy Chaffee, and uh, thank you. You have to obey me today. <laughs> and CLE Specialist Melissa Schultz. Marilyn Truby, law alum, fellow classmate, and longtime federal public defender, now retired. Jennifer Cocking, law alum, and vice president and associate general counsel for Cap Fed. I know that there are a couple of law professors here 
here who are law alums. Uh, Professor David Pierce, are you here? Hi, Mom. Thank, uh, <laughs> thank you. Uh, Professor Mary Matthews, I see you there. Stand up. If there is anyone else from the law school, faculty, or staff, will you please stand up? I'm very thrilled and surprised to see some current law students here. Will you please stand? Sarah, thank you for your kind remarks. WSBA President Jake Miller, Vice President Matt Pugesser, Ian Sharma Crawford. You guys are the best. They, oh, RJ, Scott, oh my gosh, thank you so much. This is very touching. Um, well, any other students from Washburn University stand? You are already standing. I know some of you have stood already. Thank you. <laughs> President Farley, where did you go? Would you stand for my mom? <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Mazachek, where are you? Would you stand? Thank you. I want to thank Washburn Law Alumni Director Carly Davis. And the nominating committee for inadvertently giving me this power to abuse. <laughs> Marshall Meek, president of the Washington University Alumni Association and Foundation. And Danny Funk, assistant director. Are you here? Director Funk, thank you for communicating so well to the honorees what to expect. I apologize for not returning the favor. <laughs> if there is anyone else from the Alumni Association and Foundation, please stand up. Will any Washburn University faculty, administrator, or staff who are not already standing up, please stand up. <laughs> Will all the Washburn Law alumni not already standing please stand? Will all the other Washburn University alumni not already standing please stand? You see what I'm doing here? <laughs> Last but never least, Will anyone who is here to support a student, an alum, or just Washburn University in general, please stand if you're not already doing so. Mama, look at all of these kind, powerful people who love and support education. They are hurricane of good in this world. I know that makes you happy because your whole life has been about doing good. And I never would have made it to Washburn University without you. Thank you, Mom. I love you. Thank you, Washburn.